Hello world. Sometimes, you have to face a problem when you want to use page view with each page with different sizes, but you know page view uses fixed sizing or constraints for all its children widgets. I'll show you what's the problem. Let's create a page view. Children. Container, the height of 100, and color, colors.red. Remove the const keyword. Copy and paste container code. Change the height to 200 and the color to blue. Paste again and now change the height to 300 and color to green. Now, let's reload and see. It gives you an error called unbounded height error. We have to set height for page view and that's the issue because it will also be fixed all its children's heights. Now, wrap page view with a container, height, height of 150. Or change container to sized box because we need only height or width. Reload and see. When I scroll horizontally, all the children have the same height but we want different sizes for each child. If you change the height to the width it doesn't matter because the width and height of children of page view are ignored. Changed scroll direction into vertical. Even in a vertical scroll, it has the same fixed height. Here is the solution for this. Let's create an app. After creating the app go to the main dot dart and remove comments. Control plus F and open finder and type slash slash dot star and enable regex and replace comments with empty and format code. Now, remove a title, app bar, texts, floating action button, and increment counter code. We have to add expandable page view dependency. This package will help you to create an expandable page view with different sizes of children of page view. Now, run the app. Now, create an expandable page view, inside children, copy container code and paste into children of an expandable page view. And changed width into height. Add a sized box of the height of 4 for separation of width. Changed page view scroll direction into horizontal. Remove width because it is ignored. So no need. Now you can see when I scroll horizontally, each child has a different height and that's the solution. And now changed scroll direction of expandable page view to vertical. Each child has different sizes even in vertically scroll. Create a sized box of the height of 4. Create a list of colors. Red, blue, and green. Now we create an expandable page with dynamic items or build a function. Set item count to colors dot the length and copy container code and paste into the item build a function. And add padding for the separation of widgets. For dynamic height for each container set height to 100 into index plus 1. And replace color with colors of an index. And reload the app. Now create text and add it into the expandable page view. You can see the height is wrapped to the text height.
I'll show you an example of this package. Here is a list of pricing packages and later we will add indicators in this video. Create a value notifier of integer of an index. Because we need to change the index when the page change and update into a listener. Create indicator layouts. Wrap indicator with value listenable builder and set index value notifier. So, this package will help you to solve the issue of dynamic height of page view. Hope you like this video, leave a like and subscribe for more videos.